Hi guys, I hope everyone's well today. Welcome back to the channel, or welcome if it's your first time viewing. Today's video, a little bit of sad news, a little bit of happy news. The sad news is that my dime crybaby from hell has finally given up the ghost. I think I've had it for nine years, possibly slightly more. I spent a long time trying to find the right wire pedal and uh, this was it. I picked it up when I was over in America. It's great because it has all the tweakable features and things and I've tried to repair this but unfortunately it's got really tiny surface mount components inside. I'm going to keep trying but it's not looking good. So I thought I would use that as an excuse to maybe look into a new wire pedal. I was thinking about the 535Q or maybe another one of these because I really like the way it sounds. But instead I have picked up the Custom Audio Electronics MC404 wire uh, by Dunlop. It's got two selectable inductors on the side, red and yellow, which is cool. And something that's quite important for me that I've become reliant on since using the, the Dimebag wire is having a built-in boost. Um, I think it just it lets you cut a little bit better and also in the lower reaches of the wire sometimes you can just get lost completely so it's nice to have that to bring it up I like the fact that it's a little bit more simple than the other wire but you still got I think there's internal trim pots for the Q but everything on the outside is pretty knock proof you just got a level for your boost so I haven't actually plugged this in yet so I decided to make a quick video the first time I plug it in and let you guys hear what it sounds like as well as me so enjoy So I think you'll agree, it's a really nice sounding wire pedal. Uh, I really like the fact that you've got the two different wire sounds that you can select between on the kick switch on the side. I was expecting to like the red mode more than the yellow based on what I'd read, but I think both of them are really usable sounds. Um, the red mode sounds a little bit deep to me as stock. Uh, I think I'm going to go inside and have a tweak of the trim pot. Uh, the boost is great as well. The only thing I am noticing, it sounds ever so slightly more noisy in operation than the old Crybaby from Hell, but that might be something to do with the power supply or the room or whatever. But it's, yeah, great sounding wire. So, till next time, guys, take it easy. Bye. 